right, you guys, so I just got word that my Miata is here a whole month early. I am super freaking excited. I sadly cannot pick it up today because I'm still waiting to hear back from my bank about my loan. Um, they said it will take up to 24 hours. <sighs> I just want my baby now. But anyways, um, for those of you that know, my Camaro is a lease, which is what I'm in right now. And the Miata I'm actually buying and I'm super excited about it because I haven't actually owned my own car so this is a huge step for me and it's also a massive upgrade i know a lot of people keep asking me like why do you want to get rid of your camaro so badly i'm gonna do a full video on it in the future but just so you guys can see this is what i have right now and it is a base model v6 camaro like it is the most basic camaro you can get like there's nothing in it Just picked up my new baby. It got here a month early. Look at how pretty she is. Or he, I haven't decided yet. This is my baby. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I'll take you inside in a minute. All right, you guys, I just got home. Uh, I'm sorry I did not film more at the actual dealership. I was so excited that I just I just wanted to bring my baby home. So I got my baby right over, where is it? Right over here. I'm so excited. Um, I had to take my dog out. You guys, so this is the car that I am going to be getting rid of. For those of you that have been wondering why I'm getting rid of my Camaro, it is a lease. So my lease ends next month. This one, however, I have purchased. It is mine, nobody else's. And it's really cool. Like. I don't even need to use my key, it's great. So let's take you, oh it's hot. For me outside, I got the Bose sound system because if I'm gonna have the top down, I won't be able to hear it. I am obsessed with this paint color, it's so freaking gorgeous. So that's my new baby. I'm about to go take it for a drive. I'm so excited, it's so freaking cute. Look at how little it is compared to my Camaro, it's hilarious. You guys so this is sitting in the driver's seat obviously so I've got all these fun buttons that I still have to learn what they do I'm pretty sure this is answer call hang up call volume I don't know what that does oh wait no that one skips okay that skips the music cruise control this fun stuff. Okay, so obviously I had to drive it home. It only had four miles on it, so it's now have, it now has 13. So one of the things people complain about is that there's not a lot of trunk space, but honestly, I don't even really see myself needing this much space. I mean, it's just me. Like, what am I really gonna put back there? Crap. I got this cute little spoiler. I'm in love. This car is so freaking cute. And also, it locks itself once I walk away. So I don't even have to worry about locking my own car. How crazy cool is that? I'm in love, guys. In love. All right, you guys, I just came back inside because I am literally melting. I am gonna try to go back out there whenever the sun's gone down a little bit because I think it's like 105-ish. Between 101 and 105 right now. It's just really fucking hot. So I'm actually going to take my makeup off and get comfortable. And then I'll, I'll take you back later. All right, you guys, so I'm up pretty early today. It's about 8 a.m. So I figured I was going to show you guys my car when it's actually not a million degrees out. And I'm probably gonna drive around with the top down. I'm not gonna film while I drive because obviously stick shifts and me. I'm not quite that talented. Maybe I'll get a camera mount at some point, but I'm not worried about that just yet. I'm sorry, I look like a mess. I'm trying to hide myself with my sunglasses. Don't worry about it. There's my new babe. Isn't he or she? I'm not quite sure if I want to be a he or a she. My Camaro was a he, so I'm kind of debating if I want to keep the trend. He's so freaking cute. Oh, I still need a name, so help me name him or her, it. <laughs> So I got the advanced keyless entry, which means I can just mash this and it unlocks my car. I still have my stupid <laughs> plastic in here. You know what, I'm gonna throw that out real quick. I'm gonna go do that really quickly. I'll be right back. 
I feel like today is just the perfect day to actually do this because it's like still kind of sunny but it's not nearly as hot and it's a little cloudy so yes I think I'm gonna be brave and try driving it to work later um, it is Friday and I do have to be at work during rush hour so it's gonna be interesting so let's put the top down oh I let my fiance drive it last night and now my seats all messed up eh, I gotta fix it all right, so let's start it up. Yes! This car is bay. So to put the top down, it's really simple. There's just this lever right here, and you just unhook it, and it puts the windows down a little bit. <clears throat> then you grab by one of these handles and just push it back, and it just clicks behind me. <laughs> I have to like put extra force, because I can't really reach. <laughs> it just kind of clicks back. And then that's it. The top is down. My pretty baby. Holy shit, it is so bright. So I don't know if you guys remember, but in the last video or last vlog, I guess you could say that I made of me driving stick in my fiance's FRS, I drove to this grocery store. I did stall once today. Didn't stall at all. Super proud of myself. It was a little nerve wracking, but you know, I think, I think I'm getting it. It's just practice. So I'm gonna go run some errands real quick and we'll check in later. All right, you guys, so I know I'm parked terribly. I just parked here quickly because there's a bunch of cars over there and I just wanna kinda have a little spot. This is what my baby looks like with the top down. So you know, as long as it's under like 90 degrees outside, I'm gonna have that puppy down. Look at how pretty he is. Oh, I'm obsessed, you guys. I just successfully drove from my house to the grocery store, then the bank, and then my tanning salon, and didn't stall once. I did super, super good. Look at how cute this is. So this is my baby. And before anybody roasts me apart for having a coffee in here, we have a cafe in our neighborhood that makes us free lattes, and he saw me coming in and he made it for me before I could tell him no. So yeah. All right, so call me crazy, but I have decided that the only way that I am truly going to learn how to drive my new car in like regular traffic is to actually drive it in traffic. So I am <laughs> going to drive to my Friday night bar shift in my car during rush hour. So pray for me guys. I'll update you guys and let you know how it goes. I'm scared. I'm scared. All right, you guys. So Matt is taking me on another little driving lesson today because yesterday was pretty rough. A uh, freaking semi almost ran me off the road. My first time driving stick on the highway. So now I'm a little scared. So now Matt is going to try to help me. So we'll see how that goes. There you go. You got it. The doge. Let's not hit the doge. How you feel? I'm just nervous after yesterday. Like it really freaked me out. I know. And I, that like, wasn't your fault. I like didn't know what to do. That like I didn't know how to either get out of the way like fast enough. Like either way, you know. Yeah. <clears throat> My horn is really fucking loud though. Good. She made it to Pet Supply Plus. Yay! I'm still scared. It was really scary yesterday. I know. It really freaked me out. You did fine. Claire's calling it a day. She did Northwest Highway, I'm really but not silly far. Well, yeah, you know. Thing to strip. Oh, God. Fuck. God. They suck at this. Well, yeah, it's like Fast and Furious. Shipped into 20th gear. Oh, okay. Here. How do you feel? I'm nervous. What do you want to? Pull him over. Oh, 
Uh, I guess it's my turn. Drive. Oh, I want some of those bumper stickers. I heart Chick Fil A. All right, so Matt's giving me a little lesson on the highway because that's where I like totally freaked out yesterday. So I feel a little better now. I'm just kind of like watching and learning. is a mess. It's like not even curly anymore. Yeah, it is. Oh, there it is. Yes! No! So, <laughs> we just got back to the apartment. Um, it was okay. I feel a little bit more comfortable now, so that's a good thing. Uh, the whole experience with the truck yesterday just really freaked me out. So hopefully I can get over that. So yeah, we are going to have a chill day today. I have a bunch of videos to edit, so I am going to do that. And Matt's making us tacos. Say hi, Matt. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so we just went grocery shopping and now we're playing Pokemon Go. Walking around our neighborhood trying to catch Pokemon. How freaking cute is this car? I'm obsessed. It's so little compared to your Ben's. It's so tiny. It feels so much better out here now. Currently going Off down road. here, we're wherever this is. Magic and we're, we're outside of the fence of our apartment complex. So yeah, we're going down here, trying to find some magic corps. All right, you guys, we're still going. This Pidgey's track. We're on this sketchy ass path. It's currently 9.30 at night. If my phone will... 9.30, my phone is about to die. Zero fucks given. We're going. We're going. So we have been walking around for like, I don't know, half an hour, 45 minutes. We've met two people <laughs> that are playing this game. And I'm pretty sure we also saw like four other people playing it, but they didn't actually say anything. So yeah, this game's fucking addicting. Guys, it's a sad, sad moment. He's still playing. My piece of shit phone, you can't even see right now, has died. Do you see this? It is dead. It is useless. Just got back to our apartment complex. Phone is dead. Well, technically it's on ultra power saving mode, Hello, which makes Pokemon. it black and white. Matt's over Pidgey. here bragging about his Pidgey. damn Pokemon. It's shit. bullshit. I'm mad. I want to fucking play. <laughs> Alright, you guys, so our adventure is coming to an end. We're hanging out at the pond or lake, or whatever you want to call it, in our neighborhood. Gorgeous fountain. It's all romantical. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this vlog, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more vlogs like these in the future. Thanks a lot, guys.